All right, hi everyone. So this is um, an Oras RU game. This is Stanford Premier League Week 7. And this is um, New Breed, also known as Cash Money Kev, against Hansuki, also known as Buddy Rabbit. And um, Hansuki is on the bigs, which happens to be my team. And um, we're losing 2-1 to one right now, I believe. This is, um, he got something for Silent first. Um, a bit of drama pre pre preceding this match. And Hansuki, I'm sorry, Silent versus and New Breed Greek play best of three, black, white, two are you. But then his tournament director is rightfully overruled that after he already played the first game and Newbreed won it. So um Silent Verse was busy, got subbed out, and now Hansuki is playing Newbreed and RU on this fine satellite. And um the class is currently leading the series two one there in prime position to mid the playoffs. They're currently four oh and one while the bigs are one and five, I think, or something one one and four or something like that. Um one we're one and we're one and five and they're five oh and one or four one and one or something. And um so it's gonna be two fairly offensive teams. Um they're gonna be both leading Flygon. Um just to get into the teams a bit there's Sharpedo, Galley Embor, Venusaur, Steelix, and Flygon. So Newbreed's gonna have Firewood, Grass Core, offensively speaking, and then two grounds and a Gallade. This is gonna be outraging. Um, Hansuki is gonna make a nice pivot out to Reggie Steel. He's gonna also have a Firewood, Grass Core of Embor, Venusaur, and Slow King. While there's also gonna be a Siglyph and a Flygon and a Steelix. So it's nice. Um, Firewood, gra Grass balance from both parts. And I'm just. Outrage Lock Flygon is going to outrage three turns and it's going to get killed as it does approximately 40%. Oh, now, now it's less than 30%. Sorry, it's just 28% with three turns after leftovers accounts. And Ice Punch from Registeel, which is a nice moveset from Hansuki, is going to get the nice two hit on it. So, quick 6 5 advantage for Hansuki. But now Newbury's going to get momentum. He's probably going to go to Gallade or Embor. Maybe Steelix to get rocks up. And that's a Steelix that's fine. Probably going to beat a Mega Evolution on the team since none of the others' Megas have. Megas are alive. And, um,. I gather that both will go. I gather that both will go for South Rocks, but um, alternatively, Hansuki or Flygon as he does that now, and Steelix is just going to set up rocks. And now Fire Blast can be played. And that's going to get a quick lift to Ochko v Steelix, and that puts Hansuki in a nice five-four position. Uh, sorry, six-four position with only Stealth Rocks and a bit of chip damage on the Reggie Steel. So this is a really he's in the driver's seat right now, looking good for Hansuki because of the luck and outplaying with early prediction. So yeah, let's see what they, he goes to now. Um, Sorry. But I think he's going to go to probably the Sharpedo or whichever one of the three Pokemon he has a Scarf. But there's the Sharpedo. Because I don't know if any of the Scarf Pokemon could Ochre Coat since Embor probably can't with Super Power. Um, Gallade probably couldn't unless it's got like Admin Scarf close combat and it's minus defense, so it's got like Ice Punch. And I don't think Venusaur runs in Power Ice very often. I don't think it runs Scarf very often. I'm just going to protect, and that's going to be Earthquake, so yeah, that's fine. Um, this Sharpedo is certainly a threat to pretty much every offensive team, so I'd gather that going for Protect here and then going for Ice Beam the next turn is the play. Um, I don't know if Hansuki will go to something like Registeel, and that there's a Registeel Ice Beam here that's going to do a mere 8%. Jesus, oh, but it gets to freeze. Okay, that's unfortunate for Hansuki. I don't know if he's going to stay in here and try to thaw or what. But um, that gives New Breed a bit of life after um, a poor start. And Waterfall is going to be played here. It's going to do 30%. And um, there's Thought Chance, there's Flinch Chance. And it's going to um, not flinch, but it's going to be frozen still. So that leaves it in two kill range for Waterfall. And um, it's still going to be frozen solid here. So now that Sharpedo is going to get the three kill, as it's going to be around 60% as it does so. Assuming it goes for an attack here, yup. And now um, the play for Hansuki, I'm not quite sure what it's going to be here. Um, hmm. That's going to be the Venusaur here. I believe it's able to tank an Ice Beam bar. I don't know, um, a Freeze or a Crit. But let's see here. I, I assume that Hansuki does the Calcars EV or something. But let's see. Um, Looks like that this is going to get a kill on something, rather. This is probably going to be a kill in the next two, two turns. Because this is really an offensive game from here on out. I think that Sigla from Hansuki does a lot of work, assuming that the Sharpedo dies. It, um, really, I could Oge the rest of the Pokemon with an Air Slash or even a Psychic. Um, yeah, because they're all weak to both that besides Gallade, but that's weak to the Air Slash, so it matters. Um, Slow King also does nice. You could probably tank any one hit from pretty much anything alive. And Embor even does work, but it is um, it gets really threatened on the defensive end, so we'll see. I don't know what the sets are. This is going to be Embor. It's going to be a Sludge Bomb doing 68%, so it's definitely not an Assault Vest or a bulky Embor. Probably going to be Scarf, so we could see a Slow King here, or we could see a Foddering of the uh, okay we're gonna see fly gun here that's fine wild heart wow what a prediction from hansuki that's gonna be huge so now um if this is not a choice embor which I, I think it is choice then it's going to have to be it's probably choice banded but if it wasn't choice in either way it's slower so that's a great pivot in play from bloody rabbit aka hansuki on the bigs so um he's certain she he she oh i don't know if it's a he or she um i mean because there's all kinds of rumors about hansuki being the only female brazilian but besides the point um 
Hansuki is certainly playing a bit better than Newbridge here with the Steelix. The, the Reggie Steel prediction turn 1 and the net prediction on turn 12 over there. So um, it's a 5-3 to three advantage for Hansuki here. Um, Flygon's probably going to be fodder here, but maybe they'll fodder the Venusaur. Um, oh, it's going to be a Protect. Let's go to Siglyph. Maybe that could be a fodder, or maybe it's just a chain of pivots, but I don't really see much pivot or counterplay unless they're just trying to be like a Sucker Punch, punch Choice Banded. Sorry, Sucker Punch Choice Banded Emboy, but um, we'll see here. Um, I'm not quite sure what the play is going to be, to be honest. Um, there's going to be a Waterfall, and it's going to be Dazzling Gleam, so it's going to live. So either there's no Dark move or going for the Flinch. Oh, I guess, oh, they're saying in the chat that it was Sash. So I guess that Sash, Siglyph, is um, a common set. Oh, Magic Guard, Sash, that makes sense. It's some nice counterplay to a lot of offensive things that it could kill back. So that's, um, that makes sense. He's going for the Flinch. Yep, okay. Nice new RU knowledge for me and the spectators that weren't aware of that. So now Hansuki looks to have a real clear advantage here. Um, oh, but this could be some bulky setup, Galade, because that only did 34%, but being that it's not Life Orb, um, that didn't do much at all, so I don't know, it's too indicative of much, but I think that Flygon and Embor are really going to be able to pressure this and the physical offensive end. This is going to be a pretty straightforward victory for Hansuki, but let's see how this goes. Um, Earthquake's almost definitely the play, unless he has Outrage, but even then, Outrage, I don't know if you want to lock into it. I think that lock into it is fine, to be honest, because it's probably Offensive Venusaur, but Earthquake's just going to get the kill here. I don't know if the critical it mattered, but I think that Hansuki has this pretty much in the bag with Embor and his own Venusaur in the back, including this Flygon, of course. So I, I don't see any way where that Venusaur set could win, unless it's like some random like Sunny Day, Sleep Powder, Sludge Bomb, Solar Beam set, and gets lucky and Hansuki chokes around it. But yeah, that Earthquake's going to do 56%. And now Leaf Storm's going to be the play from Kevin. So um, Kevin, aka Newbreed, is going to be down with a third of his health. Not even in Overgrowth range, 34%. And now the opposing Venusaur is going to be the um, Joyce, the line of action from Hansuki. And that's just going to revenge kill Venusaur from Newbreed. And that's going to be a nice, clean... Well, not clean. There was a couple instances of hacks. But a nice victory, pretty decisive, from Hansuki, who probably outplayed Newbreed a bit more... Um, so yeah, well played both ends, um, nice teams, interesting Siglyph set, etc. Um, and that's it, so the Bigs even out the series of 2-2, but they're still out of the playoff mix, but it was a nice game and an interesting series so far, so good game. This is Finch, peace.